Skin cancer is the most common form of cancer in the United States, with cases increasing by nearly 10% each year. In fact, one in five Americans will develop it in their lifetime, making it more common than all forms of cancer combined. What's more is that the likelihood of developing skin cancer for those who work outdoors is three and a half times higher than those who do not. The sun damage risk on job sites is so high that OSHA has identified UV as a carcinogen. And here's the good news. Though skin cancer is one of the most common forms of cancer, it's also one of the most preventable. And sunscreen is a key measure to protect against the damage done by UV rays. The Center for Disease Control recommends that all skin types use at least 15 SPF, which will block 93% of UV rays. The fairer your skin, the higher SPF you should use, with SPF 50 blocking up to 98%. To demonstrate sunscreen's effectiveness in blocking UV rays, we've hooked up this UV cam to give you an idea of how the sun sees your skin when it's protected with sunscreen versus without. We'll start with my unprotected hands. No sunscreen at all. You may notice some freckling and uneven color here. That's because skin pigmentation is emphasized. Lighter skin appears lighter and darker skin even darker. Uneven spotted pigmentation is a sign of UV damage and occurs above all in areas that are subject to regular UV rays. Now I'll apply crude sunscreen on one of my hands and we'll see what happens. See the difference? The idea behind this is the UV camera makes things that are absorbing UV light look darker. The stronger the SPF, the more UV light absorbed into the sunscreen and not into your body, the darker it will appear on camera. So this truly shows you sunscreen's effect from the sun's point of view. The same UV rays emitted by the sun are being absorbed here in this demo into the sunscreen. Hopefully you keep this visual in mind when you ask yourself, how effective is sunscreen really? For more info on the importance of sunscreen, go to the Tenacious blog on Ergodyne.com and search sunscreen.